Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I have a Costco haul today. Just got home from like spending a whole afternoon at Costco. Not quite, but I do have a bit of a drive to get there and then, you know, just going through the whole store, driving home, setting everything out to film this haul. It feels like I've just been busy with Costco all afternoon long, but I'm gonna show you everything I picked up today. I will share the final price, but I'm gonna wait until the end of this video to do that. And so I want you guys to guess, before you hear me say the total, guess in the comments how much you think I spent today. I'll give you a quick overview here in a second. Um, don't wait until after I show you everything because as we go through, I will show you what I spent on each individual item. I like to just edit that in, uh, show you what we spent on each item. Um, so it's been six weeks, five or six weeks since I last went to Costco. I really wanted to get a lot of snacks today, so now that we're into like summer mode, we are at the baseball diamond two or three times a week in the evenings. We are going to the park in the mornings, we are doing picnics, and we're just, we just have a lot more times where I'm like grabbing snacks, bringing snacks, and we're eating snacks on the go, not at home. And so if we're eating snacks at home, I typically like to buy the big boxes and just kind of, everyone can take what they want out of the big package, but I do a lot more individually packed snacks and just easy snacks for on the go in the summertime. So, all that being said, I will show you everything that I bought today. We've got the table full of food, and then over here, more food. <laughs> okay, so there's a quick overview of everything. Write down in the comments what you think I spent and then I will, um, I'll let you know at the end of this video. All right, so we'll start down here with these freezies. Elijah has been asking me to please buy freezies, so I bought this huge thing, um, 70, 70 jumbo <laughs> freezies in there. Uh, I got some non bread. The only other bread I bought was these ciabatta buns. So then, a lot of our snacks back here. We love this Brookside dark chocolate. I wish that they would sell the big bags of the orange ones. They are blood orange and peach. Those ones are so good, but they only sell those in like these individual packages. But I also bought, these were both on sale today. I also bought these ones that just come in a big bag, but they only have this flavor, the acai blueberry. These are really nice to snack on. I also just got a box of these sweet and salty bars and a box of fruit snacks. Last time, if you guys watched my last Costco haul, I bought some of these and they were delicious. Like the best treat I've had in a long time. So if you guys have this at your Costco, you need to try it. It is such a yummy treat. I also got a box of fruit to goes. We ran out of ketchup, we ran out of mustard. So, especially for the summer, we like to have lots of that. I usually don't buy mayonnaise at Costco simply because we have a pretty small fridge and this is such a big thing to keep in my fridge. But we are almost out and I don't feel like going to the grocery store, you know, to buy more in the next couple of days. So, I bought that. I also got two jars of jam. It's four fruit jam. I think I usually get berry jam and I don't know like what are the four fruits? Strawberries, cherries, raspberries, and red currants. Okay, so two jars of jam, one tub of our coffee, which has keeps going up in price. I'm sure I remember spending $13 on this and I think it's 20 or 21 now. Okay, I'm kind of zigging and zagging here and I also, this is in my way as I'm trying to lean over here. Uh, we got, oh my goodness, I can hardly reach that, but that is, let me just, let me just shove these over. I got this box of fake bars. We love these crackers, sweet potato crackers, and then some peanut butter pretzels. I think that's it for snacky stuff. Oh, and actually applesauces. Those are great for like a healthier something <laughs> for a snack. Okay, I think I'm at the salsa. Two jars of salsa there. Have I showed everything else up to this point? I think so. I got some cashews and some almonds. I saw the blueberries there today and thought, oh, those would be really good. I need to make blueberry pancakes again. So I bought frozen blueberries and then two bags of frozen strawberries. I also got two cartons of 10% cream. This is for our coffee, which really jumped up in price as well. And then I got three cartons of eggs. So these eggs, 
There are 18 eggs in each of these cartons. Typically at Costco, I buy the trays that have the 30 eggs, but then I saw the prices today and this per dozen was about three cents more than the trays. So for three cents, I bought the easier, the easier cartons. Oh, also these ones are extra large instead of large. So not a bad price. I think it works out to be 318 a dozen. I got some of this hummus. We haven't had the roasted red pepper hummus in a while, which we love. So got that today. I also got two cartons of just plain yogurt. We add berries or vanilla or something to that. A little bit of sweetener, but it's just plain yogurt. I got some cottage cheese today. They were out of sour cream, so that was on my list. Didn't get it. I did get some cream cheese. This was a couple dollars off. We love to have cream cheese on our cinnamon raisin bagels. And we do have a lot of bagels in the freezer. I got two blocks of butter, uh, some mozzarella cheese, some marble cheese, and I think that that's it for over here. And so, <laughs> hello, uh, over here I got some laundry detergent. Usually I buy this dish soap, but it comes in like three little squeeze containers. But they have, <laughs> did you just hear that? Zara just yelled outside, we got phrases. Um, but now this is how they sell it in this bigger, this bigger jug of dish soap. Four chips, okay, this is more snacky stuff. Uh, we got these chips. These popcorners, these are one of my favorite snacks and they are on sale. So I actually got two bags in there, shoved back there. And then I also got a bag of veggie straws. For produce, I got sugar snap peas, cucumbers, we're on for a good sale, some peppers, some asparagus. Gala apples were not cheap today, um, which you know, if I spend more than I usually would, when I have to buy, six pounds of apples there's 12 bucks i got three bunches of bananas some oranges three bags of milk and then for meat here i got these pepperonis some salami some ham i also got two rotisserie chickens a tray of pork chops a tray of ground beef i also got this which i don't usually buy it's just lean ground pork but I saw the price today and was like, yeah, it's so much cheaper than ground beef and maybe I will like put the two together, cook that together. It's probably, this is probably almost, I don't know, over 350 a pound and then this is maybe 250 a pound. And then these were on sale as well, these burgers. And so I thought I'd get that, stick that in the freezer for a nice, easy dinner. I have chili in the crock pot right now, cooking for supper. And on my way home, I was smelling these rotisserie chickens and I was like, oh my goodness, I wish I had just planned to do chicken and Caesar salad because I have lettuce in the fridge from last time I did groceries. And I thought, I wish I was just doing that for dinner. But now I'm looking at the time, like I haven't even put groceries away and it is 5.30 and so I'm actually very glad that I have this just like really ready to go. As much as this would be easy, this just scooping out of the instant pot will be so much easier. So we'll, I'll probably put both of these in the freezer and save them for another night. Tagging this on later as I'm halfway done putting away groceries here, but I just realized, I think I forgot to mention this. I also bought this Annie's mac and cheese. I hadn't bought it in a while because my kids prefer the elbow noodles to either of these shells, but for the Costco price, I just thought, all right, it's worth it. They'll still eat it. It might not be their favorite kind of Annie's, but I also bought that. Okay, what did you guess? I'm hoping some of you did guess. I'm hoping I'll see some guesses in the comments because I'm curious how close your guesses were. But I spent today $687. Uh, the other thing, oh, one other thing I wanted to buy today. I don't usually see items that they're out of stock at, stock of at Costco, but they were out of stock of the sour cream, like I said. They were also out of stock of their uh, Kirkland Signature brand toilet paper. So I was gonna buy that. I'll probably have to buy it at the grocery store because I don't know that we'll make it six weeks with what uh, with what toilet paper we have left. But thank you for watching this Costco haul. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed seeing what I buy. And I know there's still confusion and people comment about when's your next grocery haul. I know it's tricky. I don't really have a set pattern for my grocery hauls right now. I used to do them every other Wednesday and right now it's kind of like, I think this one's gonna go up on a Monday and sometimes I do them Tuesdays. but. Typically every other week there will be a grocery haul and I know that doesn't necessarily make it easy. You'll just have to kind of check back but every other week there should be either a Costco haul or a grocery haul either on a Monday or a Tuesday. Alright, thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.